Hello, this is Sean Burke and I am answering que evaluation question number six. What have you learned about technologies from the process of constructing this product? Well, the first technology that I used was iMovie. This was a really basic editing software on the, for the Mac. We, we first used this for our first rough cut, rough cut and preliminary task. Uh, this was very good to start off with as we didn't know much about uh, editing software, which was really helpful as it uh, helped us with basic transitions sound effects and it and we uploaded the footage to it which we then exported to Final Cut when we needed to. Uh, the next piece of software uh, we used was Final Cut. Uh, this is what we used for our final, actual Final Cut and for our later rough cuts. Uh, we used this as it offered much more um, transitions, effects and overall it is a better product to use although very expensive compared to iMovie. Um, we mainly used this as it was, um, as I said, it, as it was overall a better product. Uh, it gave great effects, which we used um, a lot, and it offered multiple layering, which iMovie doesn't. Which was a really good aspect, as we wanted that for fast-paced uh, horror movie to keep uh, audience interested in the film. Uh, the main effects we used there were colour correction. We used this as it was re uh, really effective once we got underway filming, as we were only able to film during the daytime and we wanted a night horror film, so we used colour correction to give a dark blue tone to it, which also gives a sense of uneasiness to the audience. Uh, we also used a program called Script. This is a really good program as it allowed us to upload PowerPoint and Word documents. Uh, easily to our blog, which we also used. Uh, s this allowed us, instead of just pasting documents on there, such as Word documents, we were able to upload that. And uh, you can't put PowerPoint files straight onto Blogger, so you have to use um, an embed code to put it on there, which is really effective. Uh, although we didn't use Script much, it was really effective while we used it. Another product like that was DivShare, which we used to upload our podcast to and then paste an embed code onto our blog. This was really effective as DivShare allowed us to upload when we wanted and it was a really quick upload. Uh, we had to make an account and it actually saved our previous uploads there which was also really helpful just in case we lost them. Um, the overall uh, technology that we used was Blogger to create a blog. Uh, from this we were able to uh, from just posting general information about uh, how we were getting on and how our product was coming along. We were able to learn about how to add link lists on the side which uh, allowed me to make a poll which I now have located on the side as well as keep important information such as podcasts updated and onto the side as regularly as possible and you can list them higher up as you go. Um, I also used this effectively to put The Guardian's top five of a week horror films on there, which uh, gives, which uh, redirects you to The Guardian website and gives you a view of the horror films once you click onto it. Um, I was also use, uh, able to use Blogger to effectively um, advertise my product as well as um, other people's blogs, which I used uh, by doing this, I used links. Um, to create my company ident I used the program Cinema 4D. I also use this for my own ident. Uh, Cinema 4D is created by Maxon and it is used as a 3D animator. Um, I found this product really realistic once using it, although it looks um, like a natural animator, it is really effective for general use. Um, as you can use effects such as ambient occlusion which creates um, real life reflections uh, which you would see on glass for instance which my product was. Um, I used it on my product I used a, from a plugin called Frowsy this was really good as I was able to um, as it was a free uh, copyright free and downloadable plugin which was open to the public um, I used this as I was able to put one layer on top called Flashpoint and then shatter that to show uh, my second layer which was uh, pictures.
it's all the technologies that I learnt to use as well as that I learnt to use YouTube which was really effective to give uh, to gain audience feedback would be viewing it um, it also enabled me to put videos onto my blogger using embed code as well as that uh, we used social networking sites such as Twitter to advertise our products to give um, to gain better, a better audience than what we would have already had editing softwares to find which was the best software to use and how we could apply it and use it effectively to get a better product